Hello friends. This video is brought to you by MyWayTeaching.com. We often come across such information in our daily lives like 25% off on mark prices or 10% price hike of petrol. Let us consider what does that mean and how do we calculate the values. For better understanding, let us take an example. Say onions are sold at Rs 10 per kg. And from next month, the price shall increase by 30%. Then what will be the price next month? From the question we understand that there will be a 30% rise in price next month. So let us calculate 30% of rupees 10 to find out how much hike in terms of rupees so which is equal to 30 by 100 multiply by 10 and it comes out to be 3 rupees now to calculate the new price that will be there next month a new price of onion would be equal to the old price plus the hike or the increase our old play price was rupees 10 and we have calculated that hike will be of rupees 3 that means from next month we will get onions for rupees 13 per kg it's worth noticing that in the same question if the price shall decrease by 30% then to calculate what be, would be the price we will have to do the almost the same steps we will calculate 30 percent of rupees 10 to find how much decrease in price there would be which would come out to be rupees 3 but the new price would have old price minus the decrease so that would be 10 minus 3 which would be equal to 7 rupees in case the price was decreasing hence we have found out the value once we were given the increase or decrease in the percentage of a particular commodity let's solve this question and understand further the concept we are given that price of scooter is rupees 34000 so price of scooter is equal to rupees 34,000 then further it is given that it has been decreased by 5% that means reduction in the price is 5% and we have to calculate the value which is currently the sale price so let's calculate the reduction in terms of rupees this 5% is 5% of 34,000 which would be 5 by 100 multiplied by 34,000 on calculating we get rupees 1700 and now the new price of this scooter would be old price that is 34,000 minus reduction notice since the price is decreasing there is a discount or there is a decrease in price by 5% so here new price is equal to old price minus reduction that will amount to 34,000 minus 1700 
which is equal to rupees thirty two thousand three hundred. Before explaining discount, it is important to understand the mark price. We say that mark price is the price at which article is sold when there is no discount. Or in other terms, mark price is same as the sale price when there is no discount. If there is no discount, but sometimes we get certain reductions or there is a sale in some departmental store, then the discount comes into play, and in that case, mark price and sale price become two different things. Now it's time for us to understand discount. Discount is a reduction given on mark price of the article. This is generally given to attract customers to buy goods or to promote sales of the good. We can find discount by subtracting its sale price from its marked price. That means discount is equal to marked price minus sale price. Remember, mark price can be denoted by MP. It is worth noticing that sometimes discount will be given in the question in terms of discount percent. In that case, also we can calculate discount, and it is also important to note that discount is always calculated on mark price. So, the formula for discount percent will be the discount in terms of rupees over the mark price into hundred. This will give us discount percent. Or in case we are given discount percent, then we can calculate discount by cross multiplying and finding the discount from this formula.